greatest finishes mm. in the history of college football. LSU and Kentucky, fourth quarter tied at 27. Taylor Begley and the probation riddled Cats do it again. They've got LSU down 30 to 27. Eight seconds left. Fans ready to storm the field. Marcus Randall, a quarterback for Nick Saban, who's reminding his team he's, they've got plenty of time. Of course, they've got over 90 yards to go. Michael Clayton, who caught the winning touchdown pass against the Cats with 13 seconds to go last year. He catches, gets down, Morris gets a bad. Two seconds left. Here's Jim Hawthorne of LSU. Three-man rush. Randall stops, throws it as far as he can. coming out of there. Four guys knock it down. Oh, I, just, I mean, it's a, Nick Saban said it was a lucky play. And it was, but you need a little luck. And for the second year in a row, inside 15 seconds, in this case, in the last play, LSU beats Kentucky. We're going to get into that. Guy Morris cannot believe what happened to his team. Frustration for the Cats, who have performed valiantly all year. But Devery Henderson, over 200 yards receiving. Three touchdowns on the day. Randall threw for 264. LSU a three-point winner and just a devastating loss for Aaron Boone and the Cats. I don't know, still in shock. You know, the, there's really not words put into it. You know, the locker room's you know, down to be expected. Uh, you know, it's just, uh, just so high and so low. It was it was amazing. It was amazing. Um, you know, it is the single most hurtful play ever in my football career, ever. And it was just an amazing play. Well, you feel for the Kentucky kids. They fought so hard. LSU came up with a play. There was some luck involved, certainly. But, you know, you sort of notice the premature Gatorade adulation on Guy Morris. And Kentucky has a little problem, the fans anyway, with the celebration aspect. We've talked a lot about fundamentals on this show. Players having, you know, proper fundamentals. And we also have to worry about fans having proper fundamentals. Look at this guy. Look at the guy right here. This is a Kentucky fan. He's got the tie working. Fundamentals. Hey, dude. Oh, whose team's winning? <laughs> you got to be oh. fundamentally sound as a fan. Oh. That was uh, that was tough. The look on his face as he sees Marcus <laughs> Randall celebrate is 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 worth a thousand words. It's priceless, pretty much. Mark. Oh, that play. Okay? Yeah. The, okay. the, the only thing it reminds me is my college coach Jackie Shore sure, yelling in our ears. Finish the play. It's not over. You never quit on a play. You finish the game until the last whistle's blown. And that's a great coaching tool. And a lot of coaches are going to use that saying, guys, it's not over. We're still in it with 10 seconds to go. This is a great play for you to remember. Don't forget a play like this. 59 minutes, 58 seconds. Yep, it's not over. Not enough. LSU makes the play. But you know what? The spectacular finish, which no doubt is an instant classic. It's got to be oh, an instant classic. Man. Got us to thinking. Which Hail Mary is the best? You can log on to ESPN.com. Vote. We'll have the results a little bit later on in the show. LSU, Kentucky, Northwestern Minnesota had a great one a couple of years ago. Trev, you like Colorado, Michigan, That's 94. my decade. And what about you, Mark? BC, the Hail Flutie? Well, Trev was coming out of Little League in 84. I mean, come on, he doesn't remember that. Come on, I was 13. You know, I was on the field for that one in 94. I think I would have to vote Colorado, Michigan there as well. Go. Although the, the BC Miami one is a classic, no doubt. Good, good choices in both cases. We go Western, 17, and LSU and Kentucky. You just can't see this enough, can you? It's Marcus Randall, Devery Henderson. Knock it down, but they don't. Devery Henderson stays with it. That's not the final score. No. This is the final score. Yes. 33 to 30, LSU beats Kentucky. Still just one loss in SEC play. Oh, Best subjective. Hail Mary after the LSU-Kentucky finish today. Here's what you said. Boston College, Miami, the people have spoken, and they are with Mark May again, 42.2%. But you know what? Just Never in win. case you've forgotten, maybe you'd like a reminder of just how great all of those were. Here's your ball game, folks, as Rudy takes the snap. He drops straight back, has some time. Now he scrambles away from one hit. Look, uncorks a deep one for the end zone. Salem is down there. Oh, he got it! He got it! He got it! Touchdown! 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 Touchdown, Boston College! Back goes Stewart, taking a lot of time. Time has run out. Stewart throwing it to the end zone. The ball's in the air. Caught! Colorado scores! The ball is tipped, and the Buffaloes came up with it. Time has run out. Colorado has won the game. Kustak. 
to the end zone for the win. Caught! Touchdown! Northwestern wins it! Northwestern wins it! Three-man rush. Randall. Stop. Throws it as far as he can. Well, mine's Devery Henderson, obviously. The wide receiver from LSU had a tremendous day. Five receptions, 201 yards, three touchdowns. But it's this play that we will remember him forever. You'll think back to this day 20 years from now, you'll remember this play. Devery Henderson in for the score. And mine goes to Cal.